fight in the Republican Party that's rethinking corporate power. In your work, are you seeing a realignment of in politics in this country about who's willing to take on big corporate power and who's not? Since I've traveled the country across communities, be it in Iowa, be it in Colorado, um, I've heard a lot of concern from people about how our markets are becoming more consolidated and how they feel like they can't get a fair shake. And I hear from members of Congress on both sides concerned about how monopoly power can be hollowing out parts of rural America. I hear from members of Congress representing urban areas about how people can't get access sometimes to healthy food because independent grocers are being crowded out. So these concerns are coming from all directions, all parts of our country. Well, when you first wrote the paper at Yale about Amazon, you started promoting this idea of rethinking antitrust. Has it always been the case? that there was bipartisan support for what you're doing, or is that a more recent phenomenon? Well, look, if you go back 130 years, there were Republicans who wrote some of the foundational antitrust laws. So yes, this has absolutely been bipartisan across various periods of U.S. history, Democrats and Republicans alike.